Hey guys, this is Charles from Indie Game Hustle. And in this video, um, I just want to make a quick update actually to our last video. Um, and this is regarding the blade trail for the hammer. So um, what I was working on is trying to make sure that the blade trail was working properly. And I just wanted to make sure that that information was passed on. So um, as you can see here, um, I have the blade trail working better in this uh, iteration of it. And the way that that works, I'll just show you now is if we go into the mystic hammer in this case our weapon um and uh, i'll take a look at the trail now the trail is going to be based on point a to point b and so with that said in order to see what that looks like you have to first select segment and then um those lines this point and the point here as you can see that's point b the one at the top and then we have point a here um, point A should probably be in the handle location and then we have point B should be the ending of the weapon here so um, so ideally probably it should be somewhere around like that point there and so you want to make sure you have that set up now to go back um, then you go back the box so that the box is the the uh, the box is vis visible there now the blade trail takes its information gets its information from the blade edge point a to point b so that's just something to keep in mind and then of course you can mess with these things like duration and granularity and, and whatever so uh so what we'll do is i'll just change that and then i'll just go back and we'll hit play and let's just see what happens so if i swing as you can see it's now working right where we intended it to be. All right, perfect. And so that's just something I wanted to to kind of update you guys on, just in case. Um, it, you know, we didn't uh, we didn't fix it in the last video, but I I did work with it and get it working. So, all right, cool. All right, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. For the next set of videos, I'll be releasing one every day at 10 a.m. Eastern time. So, to stay up to date on the latest 3D platforming tutorial, feel free to subscribe to the channel. If you'd like to support, you can find me on Patreon, or, of course, you can hit me up on Discord. I like to talk about whatever project you guys are working on. Of course, thanks for hanging with me. Your support is always appreciated. As always, remember, never give up and keep moving forward. Peace.